question we get a lot is, what's the best type of hammer to have around the house? And if you go to the hardware store, you're going to find many varieties, and you're going to see a lot with long handles and heavy heads, and this is more for a contractor. And when you have a claw that sticks straight out like this, this is mainly for ripping apart 2x4s that have been nailed together. For the average homeowner, they're very difficult to control. And then even some of these smaller hammers have very heavy 20 or 22 ounce heads. Again, the average homeowner doesn't like the feel of it. I think my favorite, if you're looking for just a nice hammer to have around the house, I would pick these two. One just basic hammer, 16 ounces, seems to be very easy to control for the average person. And something with a curved claw like this is going to allow you to pull nails very easily. I like a fiberglass hammer. This is probably 20 some years old and the fiberglass will keep it from cracking. If you, if you miss what you're hammering and you hit a piece of wood or a piece of metal, it's very, very durable. And then I think every homeowner should have just a very small hammer for putting up picture frames, for tacks, and it's just handy in small awkward places. So if you're in the hardware store and you're looking for a hammer to have around the house, I would go with a fiberglass 16 ounce hammer, and then if you want uh, another hammer to supplement that, I would just pick up a very small tack hammer.